Hey, what's going on, guys? Uh, just thought I'd make a quick tutorial on how to slow down your clips in Sony Vegas Pro 11. Um, this also works in other Sony Vegas's, so if you have Sony Vegas 9, Sony Vegas 10, this will also work. Um, not very difficult to do, quite simple, so we'll just go right into Sony Vegas. Um, I already imported my clips, so um, we'll just use this one for the purposes of the tutorial. Um, what you want to do is zoom in on uh, your clip. You want to find the part where uh, you want to slow it down. So I'm going to choose right as he's about to reload. So what you're going to do is make sure that the black blinking bar, you can see it, um, is on the part that you want to that you want, is on the part that you want to slow down. What you want to do is press S, which will split the clip, so you can have two separate clips and um, you can do whatever you want to each one and the other one will not be altered in any way. So uh, we'll use this. We don't really need that but we'll keep it. Um, so what you want to do first is right click on the top of your video, not this. Do not click on the audio. You want to click on the, the video part of your clip. Right click and then uh, before you do that actually you can see how it's sort of distorted if you go through it it just looks distorted in some areas uh, like right there you can see like the ghosting so what you want to do is properties right click properties then you want to disable resample and what this will do is um, get rid of that ghosting uh, make it look a lot better and um, yeah so next what you want to do is uh, actually before I do anything else um, I would not suggest using a um, a non HD clip um, usually what happens with those is it will look really bad usually so uh, using a 59.94 frames per second clip is um, a good option um, you can still do it with other clips that are less but it will be a lot more steps for you to go through in order to make it slower and look better um, this is for the purpose of this tutorial I'm just going to show you how to slow it down the easiest way so uh, yeah so what you want to do is take your your mouse or your whatever you want to call it and go to the end of your clip so you can see that little uh, arrow with the box press control and what you can do is you can make this really fast if you go right all the way to the left. You don't have to go all the way to the left to make it really fast. You can go a little bit if you want it to be a little faster. Or um, all the way if you want to make it as fast as Sony Vegas will let you. But what we're going to do is we're going to take it all the way to the right. Which if you take a clip all the way to the right while pressing control, it will slow it down as much as it possibly can. Um, yeah. So that's as far as it will go in Sony Vegas. Um, this is not... Uh, as good as Twixter, um, I, I would actually prefer Twixter because you can make it slower, it looks smoother, but uh, other than that it's not that bad. So your audio and your clip is not slowed down when you do this. Um, so when you play it, it sounds really weird and you, you can't hear anything, but since this is a reload, uh, what you could do is you could actually take the clip in again um, and then you can split it by pressing on whichever part doesn't really matter and just pressing U which will split the video and the audio. You can delete the audio and um, just take, you can take in your other clip, press U again on that uh, and then you could split it so you just have this and you could um, basically just find out for like each part where to put it and all that but that's uh, too much time really for me right now so uh, yeah so this is what you get in the end kinda looks like Twixter but not as much um, this is what it was. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and stay tuned for more tutorials. So have a nice day.